A community of Waukesha coming together today to celebrate our country's independence and continue its healing journey from last year's Christmas parade. CBS 58's Victor Hakoba was there and brings us more on how the community is healing and coming together to celebrate. Red, white and blue, marching bands and joyful children, all classic signs of summer Americana during a hometown tradition. But from Waukesha Strong posters to added security, the signs are still visible of a community continuing to heal from tragedy. I feel safe and, and it's nice to see the whole community out today. Extra precautions included motor vehicle barriers, heavily enforced parking restrictions, and increased police presence. For Margie Cavalieri, seeing her friends and neighbors enjoying the parade is an important step forward. This is wonderful 4th of July, celebrate Independence Day. It just warms my heart. It's just wonderful to see the community out here recovering from that terrible event. And part of that recovery is pure joy from the parade's youngest attendees. I love it out here. It's very cool. There's like a lot of um, trucks and stuff and they pass out candy. <laughs> along with candy, stars of hope were passed out to attendees with positive messages to go along with the theme of Waukesha Strong. On top of that, the parade featured classics like a variety of music, floats, and treats for family members of all ages. What was your favorite part? The part where there was a trolley and a school bus. I liked uh, like those big horns, still super loud. It was great to be out here, good with the family, uh, seeing all the great activities and everything. Everyone enjoyed themselves. In Waukesha, Victor Hakobo, CBS 58 News.